Welcome to the Grandson Showroom. I'm going to show you around a bit and talk you through some of the autumn winter collection highlights. Let's go. So way back in the 70s, I remember the moon boot. The moon boots come back um, in some guises and I thought, what if we did a really luxury version of it? So this is Camille, um, and Camille I think is gorgeous, real craftsmanship, beautiful sheer length lined. Um, there's the black version and the brown version, um, really uh, beautifully made, incredibly comfortable to wear. It's on our lightweight soles, as many of you already know. This is the original Grenson wedge that we did back in 2001, I think. Um, and it's just an amazing, fantastic winter boot, a luxury version of the 1970s moon boot. As I'm sure you know, uh, Nanette comes in many different guises now, different soles, different colorways, different eyelets. This is one I just picked out for the season because I really liked it. It's rubberized calf, so it's proper calf leather, but it's tanned with this rubberized finish on it. It gives it a very matte look, and it's good in the rain. The rain just runs straight off it. Uh, and we put her on this massive, chunky sole, which I love. So it's like a beefed up version of Nanette, but in the very, very matte, very practical, uh, rubberized calf. So I just thought I'd pick her out as one of the many, many Nanette um, colorways for this season. So the Nanette story continues to rumble on. She's still growing. Um, people seem to absolutely love her. Um, we just have to keep introducing new colorways every season. I picked out three particular ones for this season that I love. This calf, soft calf suede with matching shearling lining. Uh, fantastic when it gets really cold. Always on the lightweight sole, nice natural welt on there. She's a very practical, really comfortable. Look how soft the leg is. It's such a lovely boot to wear, that is. And you can wear them on day one, no blisters, straight out the door, wear them all day long. So that's the first colorway. I picked out this one because we always love a bit of a, a print, and this is snake print. Um, Nothing much to say about her, the same sole as normal, the same welt and everything, uh, but just a really, really lovely, cool Italian calf, um, but with a snake print on it. Just a bit of fun. And this one, which seems quite plain, but I really love. It's a very dark brown Colorado with suede. So it's like the classic black one, but in a very rich, dark brown, chocolate brown color. Uh, laces to match and then dark gunmetal eyelets and I just think she's come out really well and I think she's going to be a big seller. I love that one. So that's just three of the many Nanettes. Go to the website and you can see all the other colourways and all the other songs. He's the main man. So who's up for a 13 eye tall boot? This is a proper boot. It's called a 13 i comes in different colors. Um, this one here, for example, has a suede leg, so it's super soft. This one is in lovely pull-up um, oily calf, but they come in different colorways. They're on the lightweight sole. They're really easy to wear. They look fantastic. They look amazing. Um, and it's going to be the big one for the season, I think. Um, the 13i boot. I picked this little Chelsea boot out because I just wanted to kind of demonstrate um, Grenson and our kind of design aesthetic, if you like. If you look at the top of the boot, the upper, it's very much a boot we could have been making 50 years ago. It's got a wingtip, road punching, it's a simple, normal height Chelsea boot, but it's on this amazing, chunky sole that we also put Nanette on, for example. 
and just the look of it, very simple, black calf, smooth black calf, very comfortable, very lightweight, uh, making it just really wearable, um, traditional values, but in a very, very modern context. So I just really like it. You all know Sneaker One. Well, this is our all new Sneaker 30. I mean, Sneaker 30, that's how many sneakers we've done so far. In fact, we've even done beyond that now. But this is Sneaker 30, so we took Sneaker 1. Um, you can see some of the similarities with the upper, uh, but we found this really chunky Italian-made sole. Um, and we made a little stubby toe for him, so it's a slightly different aesthetic. Uh, we made speed lacing in here, um, there's a little bit of suede on the tongue, uh, but he's a super lightweight, really modern looking, really cool, lovely to wear, extremely comfortable sneaker in low top, which is sneaker 30, and high top, sneaker 31. Um, so far in white and black, but already this has been selling really well, and for next season we're going to add more and more colours because it's just going to fly.